Just because you live in a brick home doesn't mean that your home is maintenance free. We've talked about that many times on this program. James Anderson returns from uh, from approved home improvement and he's here to tell us why this is the perfect time to start thinking about having a little bit of work done on that outdoor masonry. It'll save you a lot of money down the road. Well, let's talk about protecting and preserving masonry because it's important. And for the first time ever, James brought a little demo here. He's got a, a prop. Yeah, we took this off a job site we did last week. Uh, that just shows you, just from the brick being outside, how porous it is. There's no dirt, there's no nothing. You can see what's growing on that brick. It's just grown on the brick. It's just grown on the brick. Now, we've all seen what roots can do to things like tile pipe under underground. We, we, you know, you hear about roots going through your lateral systems and all of that. Can the same thing happen with a brick? Can the roots no, actually lead to failure? Actually, this brick here has holes in it. If you look real close, you can see there's holes in it. So what's happened is those are really damp and this brick is porous. Even though I've had that off the job site since last week, it's still green because there's so much water in that brick mm. that it's, it's still living. It hasn't started to die. As you can see, part of it's dying. But that's a brick that's been out of the weather for four or five days now and sealed up. And, and it's still growing. And you know what is, comes to mind right now is that's one brick. So, and your house could literally thousands have thousands of, of the bricks chimney. in there. So uh, what can we do, though, as far as preventative maintenance? Well, preventative maintenance, the bricks, when a chimney deteriorates, it deteriorates in four phases. The first thing you can do before it deteriorates is to seal it. If you seal it, the average life of masonry is 100 years. So if you seal your chimney at one story, it's 100 bucks, two stories, 200. Your chimney can last 100 years, and this can't happen. It can't get to the brick. It can't absorb water. The mold can't grow. And we should point out that that price that he just quoted you is his price. Not everybody will do it for that kind of No, money. this is a chimney we went on last week. We took a picture of this guy's house when it started raining. The heat come up. The odor was so bad they had to leave the house because they, they, had, they didn't know they had never smelled it before. They had been getting wet on the overhang where the chimney drops off, and it was a soot inside hadn't been cleaned, so as the humidity came up, they smelled the wet soot. Mm -hmm. And until it got hot, they had never smelled the leaks. Mm -hmm. So if you start smelling like you've been using your fireplace and it's out this time of year, mm -hmm. it's a pretty sure sign that you've got a leak in your chimney structure. Interesting, never heard that before. So a lot of people out there are thinking, well, I don't want to seal it if there's already damage. How can you tell if there's damage? You well, come you out come out and inspect it for free. That right there is something we actually completely built. For, you know, that's a complete outdoor area, mm -hmm. and we did all that work ourselves. So not just the repair, you do no, brand that, new No, that was built. That that's was all beautiful. built from scratch. The pool was put in by another company. We come in, stamped all the concrete, built the waterfalls, did all the stonework. So all anything with concrete and masonry, you guys? We do it. I mean, we specialize in that. We do everything. We, our masonry I've done since I was 12 years old. And that's so, tuck pointing that we're yeah, looking at that that's needs before, to be done there. And that's before, and they got some after pictures there. But the four phases of deterioration your chimney go through that you're seeing here, first phase, that's a job that was before. That's mm -hmm. after we redid it. It wow. looks a lot different. Uh, yeah. So basically, they go through four stages of deterioration. First stage, you get a crack in your crown. That can easily be detected. Second stage is a crack crown and mortar joints start coming. Third stage is crack crown, mortar joints are gone, and then the bricks start to come apart. Fourth stage is once that chimney structurally moves, we got to tear it down and replace it. Mm -hmm. And you're not going to notice it until the second stage. Until that's it's why, it, that's it why might be too late by the time that, you do notice it. That's why it's important to get on them early because the earlier, right. the cheaper. Tell us about the deal. Okay, we got a deal right now we're doing, and we've been getting a lot of calls from this. Uh, one story home to do the whole home is 350 100 for the chimney two story home is 700 to seal the whole house and 200 for the chimney i mean it's very affordable we come out for free and we will inspect outside of your chimney structure he won't say it but i'll say it pay him now or pay him later because uh, it's that preventative maintenance that's going to keep the big pro problems from coming up thank you james for more information on approved home improvements to find out about all the services they offer give them a call at 314-780-6080